welcome back to the channel. I hope you're having an amazing week. My week has been, <laughs> actually it's been a couple weeks since, since I've actually last filmed and it's just been crazy. I know I didn't upload last week because again, I was just, oh, work has been, I would have to say like a nightmare. <laughs> And everybody on my team would admit that. That's just not me. It's like everybody. This this one thing at work has just been awful. And it's finally starting to be behind us, thankfully. We're hoping things get a little less crazy. So, yay. Let's, let's hope that that is the case. That everything's just like evening out now. Please. Please. <laughs> but yes, the past few weeks I've just been so burned out. I haven't been able to like focus or do anything other than work. So here I am now. Hey, hi. So today there are two things that I'm going to be doing. One is a thing just arrived for me today that I actually forgot that I ordered. I obviously remembered when I got the shipping notice two days ago, I think it was. And I was like, what the heck is this? Like I saw the invoice and I was like, what the hell? And I look and I was like, oh my God, I totally forgot. And so it's here and I, I am very excited to open it because it's something quite different than anything that I've gotten before. And uh, yeah, I'm just gonna stop and I'm like, and the other one, the other big thing is an announcement. So I might as well just start with that. I am going to be streaming. I said it at the beginning of the year and at the end of last year that I was making a choice to not say I might, but that I will start streaming. So I will be starting to stream every Monday at around like 7, 7.30 PST. It really depends on when I can actually finish work. Usually I'm done at six and so I'm giving myself like an hour buffer time from when I end to when I start streaming. And it's also right now going to be dependent on my friend as well because <laughs> for the first game that I'm going to be streaming is going to be Baldur's Gate 3 and I'm doing a multiplayer game with my friend T. I'm gonna call her T right now because I actually don't know if she wants me using her real name. So I'm just gonna call her T right now. For like online things, she goes by like T or T Thistle. So I'm just gonna call her T right now. I'm sure she will appreciate that. But uh, last night we set up our characters. It took us an hour and a half to actually make our characters and decide like what race and what class and all this stuff. Like it took us forever, but it's gonna be really fun. So I hope y'all will join us and see the shenanigans that come out of that. Also. If you do decide to join, please bear with me with technical issues. I am not a technical person and I am sure I'm going to run across a lot of issues at first. Uh, it has been three years since I've last streamed, maybe more. Maybe more. I'm not sure. I can't remember. It's been a hot minute, so <laughs> please bear with me as I figure this out. It's basically going to be like starting from scratch. I'm very, very nervous. <laughs> Even though you see me right here, obviously there's a lot of jump cuts and that's just me kind of spacing out and not knowing what to say. So that's why there's a lot of jump cuts in my videos. I'm scattered and so I cut a lot of that scattered out, but I won't be able to do that live. So. Hmm, I'm very nervous. The more I talk about it, the worse it gets. Oh god. Anyway, if you would like to join me, I'll have the descriptions of where you can follow me down below, but you can also follow me on Twitch at very underscore Luna, and that is where you'll find me. Yay! Anyway, um, I'm just gonna go to the thing that I have standing right here, because this is where I'm more comfortable rather than talking about myself. <laughs> Something very, very cool is in this box. It's very, very cool. And I just took it out of the plastic right here. So this cute little image was on top of that tiny little box. I don't even know. I don't remember how I came across this. I think it was through Twitter slash X. Omocat may have reposted it and that's how I saw it. Anyway, there is a store online called Super Groupies and they make a lot of collabs with uh, some of their fashion lines and accessorize and all that stuff. And so they ended up collabing with Omocat to bring out a four piece Omori wine and I wanted them all, obviously. 
<laughs> but I didn't. I held back, even though I really wanted, like, the bags and stuff. Oh my god, they were so cute. And I also wanted the other one of this, but I was like, no, I have to be good. I have to be a good person. So, I just caved. But I bought one. I bought one of the things. And it is a basil watch. As soon as I saw it, I was like, I have to, this is mine, this is mine. I haven't seen it out of this box. I'm going to open it because I'm just tired of rambling. <sighs> oh my God. Uh, <gasps> that's beautiful. Holy crap. <gasps> oh my God. Okay, I'm just going to keep it in the box for now. Fuck. Cute little basil's just like moving around, just chilling. Oh, it's so pretty. Okay, I'm gonna take it out of the thing now. Oh, it's so cute. Okay, here. Oh, maybe it's this way? Yes. This way looks right. So, oh god, I don't know when it's gonna get blurry, but here's the, the watch face. It's so pretty. And I love the color of the band. It's the basil green. Very cute. And I like how the band is actually quite small and dainty. I love it. And then on the back, I don't know if you'll be able to see this actually. Here, let's take that off. It's another protector. Oh my god. Okay, so it's very hard to see. I don't know if it's gonna get really blurry, but there's like a little basil on the back as well with some inscriptions on it. Let's see if I can read this. Oh, promise me that we'll always be there for each other. And then the other, so they came out with a basil backpack, an Omori backpack, basil watch, and an Omori watch. And I really wanted the Omori watch too, and the bags, but this was kind of pricey. And I don't usually wear watches or anything, so I was like, I don't know about this, but... Yeah, I can't hear. Usually, okay, so I am very sensitive to sound, and I'm happy to hear that it's very quiet, almost non-existent so i'm going to put this on my watch not on my watch oh my god on my wrist what wrist are you supposed to have your watch on anyway is it your dominant hand or your non-dominant hand i don't know i have a very tiny wrist apparently <laughs> it keeps sliding around i'll figure it out anyway but here it is very cute love it oh my god i don't know which way is the right way watch people i don't know what to what? I don't know how to read this watch. I know how to read clocks. It just doesn't have any numbers on it or any indication what's supposed to be the 12 and the 6. So it's just basically whatever way you want to have it. I'm so confused. There's no numbers. Please help me. Oh, it's all in Japanese. Oh no. Oh no. Huh? Let's say that. So there's a sunflower at the very top. So I'll say that that's the 12. We'll go buy the sunflower. Yay! Um, but I'm very happy and it's very, very cute. Yeah, I, I don't know what to say. It's been eons since I've actually worn a watch because A, the ticking sound can sometimes bother me. And the biggest culprit is I'm very allergic to most metals. So the watch face hopefully won't bug my wrist. Otherwise it's just gonna have like a really big rash and it's gonna suck and I wanna wear it. So I hope that's not the case. I hope I'll be able to wear this. Anyway, oh, I'm very happy. I'm very excited. And I just can't keep my head and thoughts straight. I'm just going to kick it to a very tiny small B-roll and I will be right back. everything thank you so much for joining i hope you liked the video i'm very excited about this watch it's so good i love it so much and what i like about these kind of pieces is it just looks like a cool little watch that's like not blatantly video gamey nerdy all that kind of stuff but 
if you know the game, you know the game. And so I like, I like those kind of things. Having nice little pieces that will go with like a ton of different outfits. That's kind of what this is. And so I'm very excited because I can wear it whenever with whatever and it's going to fit anything. So I can wear this. I can have basil on my wrist all the time. Anyway, oh, rambling, done. I'm sorry if this has been actually very rambly. I apologize. Before I go, if you like this video, I'd really appreciate it if you give a thumbs up. And if you want to see more of this Chaos Kremlin, I'd appreciate it if you subscribe. And if you want to see the Chaos Gremlin in live time, I, y you might want to. I, that would be cool if you joined me. Come join me on Twitch on Mondays at 7, 7.30ish. And uh, hope to God I don't have any tech issues. It'll probably happen though. But anyway, come join the mess. And yeah, that's everything. I'm gonna stop right now. Ah, uh, thanks so much for watching. I hope you have a good day, morning, night, whatever it is, wherever you are. And I will talk to you later. Goodbye. <laughs>